All right, guys, we're here uh, in San Diego in uh, National City trying to check out the bin store. In America, as this person here said. What's your name? Andrea. Person? <laughs> Andrea? You? Vidi. Vidi. Okay, cool. And we're here where? Bin store. Bin store. Let's yeah. check it out. Wow, it's bad. What's up YouTube, how's it going? So, uh, I do apologize for that vertical video, or that horrible uh, video that I put up that, uh, it's kind of smushed. It was supposed to be a short, so I'm trying to, if you guys look at on my profile or on my account, you'll see that I have a short of that uh, actual video, and it probably looks a lot better, but uh, I'm trying to convert that into a wide angle video so I can post what I actually found, or what I actually purchased on, uh, at the store. <clears throat> so. Anyways, um, I was out in San Diego for the weekend on a, uh, 4th of July. I was with my girlfriend, right? We were hanging out over there. And um, this is everything that I bought, everything that I purchased. Uh, some of it was $7, some of it was 3 and some of it was 5 It just de depended on what day, right? But uh, yeah, let's go over what I got and I'll put the price on there so you guys can see the value of what I actually you know, came out with. I, and I, I would say I spent less than a hundred bucks. Trust me, worth it. Uh, there's more stuff. It's just the other stuff was kind of like you know water balloons, a pool, whatnot, little things for the kitties. You know what I mean? So with the first stuff, so food items are like three bucks any day. Um, but yeah, you know I bought it for my brother. He didn't want it, so it's just in my possession now. Um, girlfriend bought me these cables. Very useful. Girlfriend bought me these cables. Right? It's a um, this is DVI to uh, that MacBook uh, <clears throat> Thunderbolt cable. Useful, I'll show you the price uh, of that product there later. Or I'll probably add it on the screen. I have a printer cable here. It's pretty long, it looks like, it looks like it's about six feet. This one is useful, HDMI to the Thunderbolt cable. Oh, I needed this for my MacBook Pro. I don't have it anymore though, selling it. Anyways. I have a HDMI hub or, you know, little connector that allows me to connect three HDMI cables. This is super useful, like 20 bucks, I think, on Amazon. And then this is another DVI to Thunderbolt. Super dope. Useful for the future. Uh, next, 
I bought some coffee. I have a coffee machine in my office that I use all the time. And I wanted to try it. it smells really good. It's not opened. So, it's pretty dope. For three bucks, hey, couldn't beat it. Three dollar coffee. Um, oh, girlfriend bought me this. Love it. I'm actually using it right now. I'll show you guys how it looks in a little bit. But, uh, yeah, it's for the camera. So I can do vlogging. She, um... Thought it was a good idea, and it is a good idea. Great idea that she bought it. Love it. Thank you, by the way. All right, uh, back to the more cables. Uh, this is the HDMI to USB to USB-C. It's like a splitter. Not sure what it's used for yet, but I'll double check. <laughs> and then here's another USB-C cable. Uh, USB to USB-C. Pretty dope, very useful. This is a uh, refillable glue boards for uh, eco-friendly uh, mosquito traps, something like that. Very useful. They go for like 12 bucks online. That's pretty cool. And then I bought this here. Oh, the USB-C hub. Super dope. If you have a MacBook Pro, this is what you need. You know, you can, like me, edit videos with the US, with the, uh, uh, with that SD card reader. Useful. Um, and then a hat rack. I have a bunch of hats now. Also, San Diego, you gotta represent, buddy. All right. Next. Oh, perfect. I bought a notary book. Don't need it yet. Uh, I still have to fill the other one out. Um, and I do need to do an update on the notary thing. Somebody asked for it, so I'll get to it. Don't think I'm ignoring you. But uh, you know, I'm just doing a lot of videos. Anyways, super cool. This is like 20 bucks online. I'll double check so you guys can see. Uh, let's see oh, the gutter guards I bought it for seven I know that for sure I, I just I, I was gonna use them for myself for the house I, I probably will I don't know yet or I can sell them we'll see uh, next this is for my daughter um, it's a Lilo and Stitch it's like limited edition diamond I opened it already so she could play with it but I just boxed it all up so you guys can see what I got um, Oh yeah, the fin. This is probably the second most expensive item I got. And I paid $5 for this. Nobody wanted it. And uh, it's crazy. Uh, let me open it up so you guys can see. All right, so still have the sticker on there. Brand spanking new. The, you know, protector, uh, little stickers on there. Everything's still there. Incredible. For five dollars, retails for like three hundred bucks. Crazy. So I'm definitely gonna resell this one. Uh, I did put it on eBay. I haven't gotten any views on it yet, so maybe it's just not a popular item. Hopefully, I get to sell it. I, I'm putting it on for a discount, so we'll see what happens. Let's go with this. This is Baby Ghani. It was a box that I bought for I think seven dollars. It was filled, but they're basically. Just baby wipes. I have a daughter and trust me, <laughs> this is saving me a lot of money. It was filled, by the way, just so you know. Been using them. All right, next. Oh, this right here, the ax. Oh man, I bought like five of these. I gave four to my brother, um, but these are super dope. These are like 30 bucks on Amazon. Well worth the money. You know, I think I bought these for like seven bucks or five bucks. I can't remember. Super dope though. There you go. All right, uh, next I bought this for my new MacBook Pro. It's a 15 inch 2016 quad core i7 um, that I bought for my, for uh, editing videos. It's amazing on that laptop. I love doing video editing on there. Um, oh, which I need to talk about later on. Uh, but yeah, anyways, you know, I got a little protector, like a case that I could travel with, a little travel bag. Pretty dope. Toss it out of there because I don't need it. And then the creme de la creme, right? The cream of the crop. This is what I bought for, I think I paid three bucks for it. This box here. Oof. This box has, and I've counted, me and my girlfriend, uh, <laughs> counted every single one. She organized them for me. And then we kind of like counted it together. But anyways, um, 160 of these little things in here cost me $3. And I looked at 
looked at Amazon and they're going for $10 each, right? If they're $10 each and I have 160, that's $1,600 in this box. Can you guess what it is? If not, just fast forward. Anyways, just kidding. Anyways, um, it's this. It's called Syntec. It's basically a USB to U USB C adapter. I have 160 of these and they're going for $10 on Amazon. That's unbelievable. And I paid $3 for this whole box here. Look at it. Crazy. I'm going to put them online and hopefully I get to sell them. Um, even if I sell just to make my money back, it's going to be totally worth it. Like I could sell these for a dollar and I'll still make my money back for everything that I paid for, um, you know, what I just showed you online or on this video. All right. So while editing, I forgot to uh, put in the grand total or talk about the grand total in the totality, right? Of everything that I've purchased, the actual book value is $2,041. So I only spent about maybe 100 to 150, maybe less. I'm pushing these numbers, trying to be conservative. Well, not too conservative because I'm actually giving you out of the budget number here. I probably spent maybe 70 or $80. But to be safe with cushion gas and everything, I'm putting like 100 to 150. But I lost a receipt. Don't even ask. I probably, I could look at my bank statements, but it doesn't matter. But yeah, again, you know, this is at the bin store in San Diego. So if you guys are interested in making money, or reselling stuff or just getting stuff for yourself at a discount. Definitely check it out. I'll put the address online or on this video so you guys can go and visit it. Uh, I think Saturdays is when they replenish. Not sure. I don't live in San Diego, so you're gonna have to call them or go online, figure out anything you can uh, find out about this company. Uh, it's cool that they popped up. Hopefully they pop up around other locations near Long Beach, LA area, OC area. It would save me time, save me gas. But uh, if not, I still go there every week just to hang out in San Diego. So I, I usually always stop by and find a bargain. But uh, yeah, you guys, hopefully you guys enjoyed the video. And again, I do apologize for the horrible camera quality. The beginning of the video was supposed to be a vertical short. So again, look at my channel. You'll see the video in a perfect angle, vertical on your phone. Like the video, subscribe. Um, I'm at 179 subscribers and 60,000 views. Thank you guys so much for that, by the way. Just wanted to say that. Uh, super excited. I can't wait to make more content for you guys. I know it's not you know super exciting, but uh, slowly I'm trying to build this account for you guys so you guys can see what I do on a daily basis. Check it out. See you guys.